that one. No, that's not a jump rope. That's a jump rope. Yeah, but what's okay? But jumping then why rope. Why does it talk bank. about a squirrel on the box? I think people were like huh. out of their minds back then, completely. And like we're not now. But like, what? <laughs> yeah, what? Two dollar the barrels are not that old. I don't think they make them anymore, but they're still in circulation. That maybe. Barrel is dated at 2009. Yeah, wow. see, not that old. <laughs> maybe not old to you. I mean, I was old to you, but not old to me. It's all comparative, dear. Okay. <laughs> now I'm talking to the phone. Talking to my three viewers, yeah, I'm famous. <clears throat> I remember this one video, it was like a perfect timing sort of video. Yeah. And this one guy was streaming a game and the viewers in his chat were talking to him in real time. Mm -hmm. And they said, would you stop dropping us? And he's like, what do you mean? And then the camera fell over. <laughs> oh, funny. <laughs> Look at these guys in tuxedos or not tuxedo. Yeah, it's a tuxedo with a top hat. <clears throat> I know that's supposed to be the Washington Monument, right? But oh. it looks more like an improvised stabbing device. <laughs> an improvised stabbing device? Yeah. yeah. That could be. Could be if it wasn't behind locked, locked uh, thing. Mm. Oh my gosh. Alex, like, we're not even, oh! Who would want to store that on their desk for fear of falling on it? Like, it's sharp at the top. Yeah, we're getting into the Revolutionary War, mm -hmm. I believe. Or all sorts of wars here. Um, when was the Revolutionary War? Because these guys, those are terrible pieces. <clears throat> no, like, these guys here. Oh, those, okay, those guys. No, I know that's not the Revolutionary War. That's more like World War One up there. One or two. The hats that they wore look like one. Could be two. Don't know. That gun is definitely World War Two. That one that that guy's crouching, he's holding. Okay. Yeah. That's two. And then we got little toy soldiers here. Cavalry, cavalry. 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 How do you say it? Ca I say cavalry. Cavalry. Okay. Oh, people might also say cavalry. <clears throat> yeah, look, we're getting into some some cars that you might like, huh? Mm -hmm. If you look behind you, you'll notice that during the Disney area era, oh yeah, the toys looked a lot better, but still slightly creepy. Yeah, look at these old old ones. That's just yeah. weird. There was a real old one there. When did Disney start? I can't remember. I Not a huge Disney fan. <laughs> Less creepier though, mm. kind of. Until you get to those hanging <clears throat> dolls, I guess. They're not really hanging. No, they are. They are <clears throat> hanging. Not hanging in the sense that you think of hanging around the no. noose neck hanging, but I know what you mean. Mm. That's even worse because then they got something drilled into your head. Mm hmm. You know, their heads were designed to be hung. I know. Oh, that is um, the Lone Ranger. Popeye. Lone Ranger was a pretty short-lived show, wasn't it? <clears throat> yeah, but popular. Seemed like that was the 50s. Mm -hmm. I mean, I could be wrong. I watched a little Popeye when I was a kid. I think it's funny that people wanted to represent their daily life um, like like this. Mm -hmm. Or like um, carting around pigs. It's like, we work. Mm -hmm. We work. Alex, really? We work, <laughs> we work on a farm day in, day out, and then we're going to play at working on a farm. Because <clears throat> when you're resting from working on a farm, what do you want to do? You want to play like you're working on a farm.
too busy working or resting. Yeah. It's <laughs> probably the kids that um, could afford it and didn't have to work on a farm that played with them. Yeah, it was probably actually the more of our people that played with stuff like this. Yeah, probably. Their kids. <clears throat> oh, look at this one. That must be a fire, a fire wagon. Um, well, with talking, the ladder, see? If we're talking 1800s, they usually just had kids that ran around with buckets next to wells. And then we have here yeah, this one. Like a fire brigade. Yeah, because of the, the big the long ladders, ladder. Yeah. That's what I said, the ladder. Mm. Well, at first I saw this. Yeah, and then there's another one with a ladder. And then the, the, the hats that he's wearing, that's a typical yeah. fireman hat. Why is it shaped like that? <clears throat> For what purpose? I don't know. Well, it's to protect your head from falling debris, but yeah, maybe but it's the to... the whole bill is... I don't know. So he could... It's shorter in the front so he could see. Mm -hmm. And it's longer in the back so that it deflects things from hitting his back, maybe? That's my guess. That's a possibility. That is my guess. If there are any, any firemen watching this, I doubt there will be. Also, <clears> you, you can let us know. That wild horses are extinct. Hmm. There, there are no wild horses anymore. No, There's I... only domesticated horses and feral horses. I didn't know that. Getting into the. Oh, see, fire patrol right there. And they're wearing the very distinctive hats. Mm -hmm. Except the guy driving. <clears throat> I don't know if they're still if they still wear that type of hats. It's hard to say. I think they do. Same shape at least. Oh, Alex. Oh my god. What? Oh that is just my god. bizarre. Is that a yen? <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I'm glad it's behind glass. What about that thing to the right of it as well? Yeah, it looks like a squirrel or a whoever made those was probably a demon. <laughs> Probably trying to in-capture a demon. Or was possessed. Oh, look, I wonder if these are real badges. Do they have numbers on them? Yeah. Fire Department 5. Minneapolis. Minneapolis. Oh, interesting. <clears throat> There's Tacoma. Hmm. Oh, look at the old bicycles. Hmm. And the kids riding the bicycles and pushing the... See, look at it. They have boys riding the bicycles and girls pushing the prams. Mm -hmm. Man, training them young. Okay, somebody has to take care of the kids, I know. Yeah. I'm pretty sure back then the wife didn't want to do the back breaking work all day. Although, taking care of kids is back breaking work. Yeah. <clears throat> Depends. Little farm animals. What is that? Oh, it's a bowl. Oh, here's some more Mickey Mouse stuff. Looks like they tried to cross a bowl with a dog. I know, it does look like a dog, doesn't it? And you have old football stuff. It is football, right? Notre uh, Dame, Notre Dame. Dame. Oh, look at the helmets. It's, it's old. It's rugby. Is it rugby? It Are you sure? The helmets. No, look at the, look at the ball he's holding. They carry the same type of ball in rugby. Do they? It just doesn't have the threads because they usually don't throw it. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, Fred Flintstone. Look at that. Hmm. Charlie. Charlie McCarty. That was an old. Um, what do you call it? The dolls that they the the. Um, that face has been a subject of some horror stories since then, by the way. I'm sure. Oh, notice <laughs> the white and skinned and the rosy cheeks. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that was a typical look back then. Was sick on something. Ventriloquist. <clears throat> oh. He was a famous ventriloquist. Mm -hmm. I was trying to think of it. Yeah, he's had ventriloquist dolls made after him. That's why he's the subject of horror movies. Because ventriloquist dolls are creepy as hell. <laughs> Is this the Titanic? No, it's not the Titanic. It's the Leviathan. Leviathan. Interesting. I don't think I've heard I of it. I do remember the Titanic having a sister ship, though. I don't think it was the Leviathan, was it? No, I don't think so. Go Navy, yeah! Go Navy. <laughs> Grandpa was in the Navy. Yes, he was a radio operator. He was a radio operator. He tried to teach me Morse code. Yeah. Hey, you never know when Morse code will come in handy. 
No. <laughs> SOS maybe, but that's about it. He taught me i would forgotten all so, the letters, but... The funny thing is, the only good reason to know SOS is because you can call for help without most other people knowing about it because most people don't know Morse code. <laughs> you know what SOS stands for, right? Save our souls. Save our souls. I think that could be used in today's world. <laughs> There's a lot of souls that need saving. Mm -hmm. Getting into the circus. Can I buy those for a penny? <laughs> Ugh, tin. Oh, look at these little wobbly dolls. Oh, wow. Santa and Mrs. Claus, I believe. Although, why Mrs. Claus is wearing a that's that not, is Mrs. Claus. not Mrs. Claus. Okay, it's just Santa and some weird dude. Wherever it is, they are extremely shocked to be next to Santa, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, did they not know how to paint eyes back then or something? Because <laughs> yeah. it looks like they're all just it being looks, squeezed in the middle and popped no, out. It looks like his eye was a bit blue or something. <laughs> yeah. What? Baby bunting? And there's, there's the pale skin and the rosy cheeks again. Those are boxes that you just used to stack. It was a very complicated game, Alex. I don't think you'd understand. I wouldn't. <laughs> I think my brain is a little too complex for that. I don't think most kids would understand just <clears throat> stacking blocks. Mm -hmm. For what purpose? <laughs> Spatial reasoning. Spatial reasoning? You're yeah. funny. Depth perception. <laughs> Balance. And eye coordination. And balance. No, stacking blocks. Would and then the best blocks. part, stacking them up and knocking them down. Yeah, that's the best part. <laughs> you, you, you train your brain, <clears throat> and then you relieve stress. There you go. <laughs> I just want to reach out and touch these, Alex. That looks like it was made in the 60s or 70s. This one here? Dress up. Yeah. yeah, you're right, just it does. Picture. It does. I don't know, maybe the 80s or 90s. No, these blocks had another purpose. Is it because of the letters on them? Yes, and what could you do with letters? <laughs> well, you usually could form words with them. Very good. But not sentences, because you usually never had enough blocks. That's true. That's true, just words. Just words. <clears throat> oh, and look, plus, we got Smokey the... You never got punctuation with the blocks either, so you couldn't... That's true. <laughs> Smokey the bear. Prevent forest fires with a combustion engine that burns <laughs> fuel. <laughs> Do as I say, not as I do. Yeah, I hate people like that. <clears throat> okay, this is creepy. This is ultra creepy. What? I feel like it's a famous person, that one right there. It could be, but that's just really creepy. I don't wanna, I don't wanna look at these. Okay, now we're getting into Santa, 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 Santa. Santa. And I don't know who that is, but. Maybe it's a witch. No, oh, that one there. Oh. I don't know what that one is, but oh, that's look at this one. And that's a that's witch with a glamour. Okay, why would it have a bell on it? A bell? Yeah. Uh, it's a cart <clears throat> with the buggy with a thing that, and a. I don't get that. Some sort of archaic torture device. What's a torch? How would it torture? I don't, Come the on. bell does it. The bell obviously tortures the kid. If the, if the kid fidgets too much, the bell rings and the kid gets scared out of its mind. Yeah, and that's what it has wheels on it, so that if uh, something pushes it and starts going downhill, mm -hmm. yeah, I think that if they're trying to keep the but kid the safe, don't only, put wheels on it. The bell would only ring if it started moving and then stopped or slowed down. Otherwise, the bell wouldn't really ring. Oh, all right. They didn't have brakes back then? Yeah, they weren't too smart back then. Either. Halloween? Now we're getting into themed. <clears throat> and Easter. Where's Easter? Right above Halloween. Right above Halloween. Oh, and pilgrims, so that would be <clears throat> Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Sorry, I don't know what's in my throat. It keeps having to clear it. And then a random 